We're headed to church. First, we're gonna go stop and get a Starbucks. The paper didn't come, so Marvin didn't have anything to read, but now it's here, so. Sorry. Cooking up some stuff today. Looks delish. We are out here at Crispy and Puppy Tacos. I think it's called Crispy and Puppy Taquitos. Anyways, we've got Marvin with me. We just finished showing the house over on Riggs again, and we were starving. Starving like Marvin. Marvin actually really was starving. So, we're here. We're gonna try some new things, and I'll show you it when it arrives. First, we ordered queso and chips, and then we ordered um, stuffed jalapenos. Marvin, stuffed jalapenos with chicken. Marvin ordered the crispy and puffy tacos chicken, and I ordered the enchilada plate with a beef enchilada and a chicken enchilada. And then Marvin commented that we should probably not go out to eat when we're hungry, so, <laughs> because we ordered almost everything on the menu, including Mexican go. Marvin is trying the queso, chips and queso. Give us a first impression, honey. Is it good? You like the chips? They look a little thick. Okay. So Marvin got the tacos and it looks like the outside of the tacos has some sort of something on it. Yeah. <clears throat> What do you think that is? Like chili or something? So I'm gonna take a bite of that in a minute, but I got a chicken and a beef enchilada and our stuffed jalapenos should be coming out shortly, but I'm sure we'll be full by then. <laughs> Honest review time, honey, what do you think? It's all right. Yeah, I just thought it was all right. Sun's out now, so. Maybe Marvin. It's, still cold. it's not that cold out anymore. Yeah, I mean, it's still cool, but you know, it's Texas, so. We are at our gray house, and Marvin wanted to stop by so we could look at it again. I can't wait till we're moved in. I can't wait till this is where we come home to. So, pretty exciting. It'll be here before you know it. But let me show you something really quick. We have these piles of dirt, they're grading the yard which just means they're kind of leveling everything out. We have dirt over here. So we're gonna see if our friend, what they're gonna do with the extra dirt. They don't need the extra dirt. If they're just gonna haul it away, we're gonna give it to our friend down the way. Here's our door. Oh, Marvin wanted to come to the house so he could see the backyard and see how they had graded the backyard. I wondered why he wanted to come here. But as you can see, our backyard's not really like a backyard. It's just more like area. And yes, it does not have grass yet, so it doesn't look as good as it could, but it just kind of slopes downward. So I'm not going to really have that much of a backyard. So what are you thinking of the house, Mr. Har? I love it. Can't wait to get in it. Me too. Oh, somebody's already eating. Had Whataburger. We did notice, I don't know if I told you guys or not, but there's a scrape right here. I don't know if you can really see it on camera. But I'm going to see if they can buff it out or something. And then, of course, there's the hutch area. We have Snowbound White on top, Sherwin-Williams and Westchester Gray on bottom, both by Sherwin-Williams. And you can see he's prepping to do the tile. Underneath, we were gonna have like little cubbies here, but instead we're just gonna do tile all the way. So if we have wet shoes or something when we come in from the garage, we can just tuck them under there. And they're of course gonna put some hooks up here and I cannot reach that, but it's okay. I'll be like, Marvin, come get my hat down. See? And then this is our like utility closet. 
It's got a couple shelves, and then we'll just put our like vacuum and stuff in there. But you put utilities in there, like the water, the gas, and electric. Oh, you got jokes. Okay. And those are our glass front cabinets, and we have the glass wet glass tiles. We changed from a darker gray tile, which I'm really pretty happy with that we changed. Marvin's looking at our pantry. It's a walk-in pantry. Plenty of storage space in there. Looks really good. And this is the guest room. I love the two big windows in here. I think they look nice. And this is the bathroom. They've started grouting the tub shower area. It's our countertop. This is the guest closet. It's got two shelves and they'll have two uh, rods for hanging clothes. And this is the bathroom. Oh, that looks nice. I like. Okay. Where are they putting the switches? In? Electrical and the plumber, the electrician and the plumber are coming on Monday. They'll put in all the switches, put in all the faucets and such. And this is where the cats will lay, I hope. That's my idea. And then this, of course, is my office. It's got a nice big closet. And I'll put in a couple filing cabinets in here, probably. I'll put a desk here. I'm kind of thinking of doing like an L-shaped desk, but I'm not sure yet. I'll have probably a mirror there so I can do my outfits of the day. This goes to our house. This little cabinet right here is gonna be for uh, my baking pans. I have one at the house right now, but that's what that one's for. In case somebody is wondering, what's that little, what's that little cabinet for? Well, that's what it's for. Back here is the way to the master. So you're right here. You go that way to the master. You go that way to the laundry room. And Marvin sees something. What is it? We already got a bug in our house? Oh my goodness. I'm not buying this house now. Here's our wonderful, wonderful barn door. What are you doing? It's our barn door. I love it. And it goes right here. They're looking for fixtures to match. I think they're looking for like brush, brush nickel or satin nickel um, things to hang the door. I don't know what it's called. I don't know what Marvin's doing back there, but here's our wonderfully, awesomely huge vanity. I love it. I can't wait till they put the handles on it and stuff. We already bought the mirrors, but they won't be in for about a week or so. And restroom, it's not in yet. I think it comes in on Monday with the plumber. This is the master shower. He has not started grouting this yet. But it's looking pretty good. When they put in the granite, looks like they broke something down there, so they'll have to fix that. Master closet. We are going to have a rung over here and then over here. But um, we've got the rungs there. And we've got rungs over there. We've got built-in shelves. I'm going to tell them not to put a rung up here because that doesn't even make sense. I'm just going to use it as a shelf. Hello, everyone. It is Sunday night and I am getting ready for the week, the upcoming week. I'm gonna set out, kind of pick out what I'm gonna wear this week and we just finished planning out our menu for the week so we kind of know what's going on and what meetings I have, what events that we need to attend and things like that. So this kind of helps us have a, just a good week because we know what our plan is and it's not like a surprise, not like, oh my gosh, I didn't know we wouldn't have time to make dinner. So now we have to eat out again because I'm actually getting tired of eating out. So, although we did eat out lunch today at the new place and it was just um, okay. Would I go again? Probably, but it wouldn't really be my first choice. Just nothing was like, wow, this is so good. It, wasn't a restaurant restaurant because like a restaurant, Mexican restaurant's gonna have chips and salsa on the table. It doesn't, you have to order like chips and queso. They don't have like chips and salsa to order. 
and then it comes out and it's all like takeaway stuff. It's like plastic styrofoam stuff. So anyway, it was just okay. And I'm sure it'll get better, but we weren't like, wow, this is awesome. So anyway, I'm just finishing up, getting ready for the week and I've got paperwork that has to be signed, but title company is closed tomorrow, so I can't do it tomorrow, but I'm prepping it. So first thing Tuesday, I can get it done and then not have to worry about it. And then, yeah, just wrapping up because in just like two weeks, we're closing on this house that we're in now. And then in three weeks, hopefully we're closing on our new house. So that's not very far. <laughs> so um, tomorrow I'm gonna post about the things that I'm gonna sell and like the kitchen table, the couch and the love seat or the chair and a half is really what it is with the ottoman, the um, refrigerator, possibly the washer dryer, so I'm going to get those things ready to post and for sale and hopefully somebody will take those off our hands. Also, I have bookcases that went in my old office that I'm not putting in the new office because I'm really trying to streamline in the new office. And I was looking at artwork tonight because we never really finished putting artwork. I was going to put all these like prints on the wall. I didn't. And now we're moving. So in the new bathroom, there's not really a whole lot of wall space in the master. There's just like room for one print maybe maybe a couple on the vanity side I don't know um but there is definitely room in the bedroom to hang some stuff so I'll be checking into that and then just like stuff that I might want to put look for ideas on Pinterest and stuff and then in the guest bathroom we have two guest bathrooms we have like one that goes to the guest bedroom that's attached to it. it's the Jack and Jill that goes with my office and then we have one that's just like a half bath so I was just gonna put like, a, put like a cute little sign there, you know, I don't know. But here's something I saw. Um, I'm getting tired standing up, that's crazy. But okay, so when we were in, was it, I wanna say it was in Spokane. It don't, it was not at Indawa Coffee Shop, but I think it was at maybe the Atticus Coffee Shop. Or maybe, no, maybe that was in Little Rock in the Nexus coffee shop. So when you're standing in line for the restroom, they have like this like thing on the wall, like just like a poster, but it's not even a poster, it's like eight by 10 or whatever. And it's like a little story that you read while you're standing in line. So you have something to do while you're waiting to go to that. One. And so I thought that might be kind of funny to put something like a little story in the powder bath and maybe like periodically change it out. So like if people come over, they read it and then the next time they come over like, oh, I read it. Oh, oh wait, that's like a new thing. So anyway, I might try to do that. Seems a little ambitious for me to actually change that out regularly, but I just thought it would be kind of funny. Um, not really like, <laughs> but just kind of like, oh, look, that's kind of funny, clever. So I don't know, what do you guys think about that idea? Leave me a comment below and let me know if you think that that's like an idea or like I should just like, no, Lisa, you're good. Just, no. Nah don't do that anyway i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because i have things to do and it's getting a little bit later i took a nap today and so um i need to still go to bed kind of on time because if not i'll be up for like for forever so and that's not good anyways i will see you guys tomorrow bye